Hey, hey, it's Todd the Dirt Man. No, it's hey, hey, it's Todd the Dirt Man. Welcome back to another Let's Get Dirty with the Dirt Man. And today we're gonna do a amazing, a fabulous, a great tasting recipe that really isn't that difficult. And we are gonna be doing dirty stuffed pork chops. That's right. Here's all the ingredients. We've got the olive oil, we've got the uh, garlic, we've got the pepper jack cheese. So a lot of times in these recipes you see mozzarella or mozzarella or however what they kind of call it. I like to say mozzarella. I really like pepper jack. Gives it a lot more flavor. And then we're going to also stuff it with not only the cheese, but we're also going to do the spinach. And then we have the two kind of dirts that we're going to do on each one of these. We're going to do one with the original marinade because I like it a lot. Oh, it's so sweet, it's so good. And then we got the original dirt, the all-purpose, and we'll do that with the other one. And here we go. All right, now we are gonna, you're gonna lay your hand flat right here and you're gonna stick the end right inside. And you're gonna stick it in about halfway. As you can see, I went from here to here. Got the little pocket, and now we're gonna do the next one. So again, very, very simple. Yo, dirt man. There's a lot of fat here. What's up with that? Well, fat is good. Fat is flavor, and I like fat. So we're gonna start right here at the end. Goes in all the way across. See how my hand is, is pressing down on here? Right on the meat. Look at that little pocket. Beautiful. Now we're gonna now we're gonna do the stuffing mixture and we'll move 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 forward. All right, so we preheated the pan. Throw a little bit of olive oil in there. And we're gonna take some garlic. Now I can see a nice teaspoon of garlic. Mm, yummy, yummy. And then you're gonna throw some Todd dirt, let that heat up in here really nice. Olive oil will be good. And then we're going to take the spinach. Mix that up really nice. This is a very quick recipe of putting this thing together with the, with the pork chop and everything. I mean, the, the uh, spinach only takes about five minutes at the most. We'll let this wilt down. I'm going to sprinkle just a little bit more Todd's dirt right on top. Mix that up. Todd's dirt is just going to bring out the flavor of this. It's going to be so amazing. Alright, so the first thing we are going to do is we're going to grab some of this cheese. We're going to stick it inside. Alright, now we're going to stuff the spinach inside. Good inside. And then another piece of cheese. Leave that in there. All right, now let's do this one. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. She goes, I'm ready to get dirty. Hold on, excuse me. I'm ready to get dirty. We're gonna do, let's do this one with the olive oil on the Todd Sturt. So we're just gonna put olive oil on the outside. Very simple. Sprinkle some Todd Sturt on there. Because what is Todd Sturt good on, Josh? Everything. Everything. Oh yeah, look at all the beautiful herbs. Look how pretty that one looks, Josh. What do you think? That looks great. Oh yeah. All right, now we're doing the second pork chop. I just washed my hands. Again, I'm a dirty guy, but I try to keep it clean here. So you can't see everything. So now we're just gonna put the original marinade, cover the top, just the same like this. So this is gonna be a little bit more 
herbal and citrus flavor, where the original dirt is really gonna be more of an herbal flavor. Either way, it's gonna be amazing. Flip it over, put that right here on top, lay that on there, a little bit more. I'm gonna let this sit for about 20 minutes to a half an hour, and then we're gonna go check you out on the grill. All right, we got the beautiful pork chops ready to go on outside, right here on the beautiful Weber grill. Oh yeah, time to get dirty. Put that right on. Oh, that sound. One of my all time favorite sounds. Oh yeah, time to get dirty. And we'll, we'll check these on in just a few minutes. All right, let's, pull, let's turn these over. Look how pretty they are looking right now. Yeah, look at that. Oh, look at it oozing. It's starting to ooze. It's looking pretty. Let's flip it up another couple minutes and we'll be done. All right, let's open this bad boy up. Oh yeah, look how pretty that looks. Oh yeah. Look, Josh. Look how it's oozing. The cheese is just oozing out of here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you're gonna love this recipe. You're gonna love this recipe. All right, let's check out these dirty stuffed pork chops. Let's cut, cut one open. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at the cheese. Let's cut open this one. Look at that. Now tell me if that wouldn't be absolutely fantastic fantastic for dinner tonight. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Wow. I'm telling you right now, that might be one of the best things I've made yet. That is fantastic. You're gonna love it. Not that difficult. Man, the flavors are good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to subscribe, please. And last but not least, you know what I'm gonna say. It's always a good time to get dirty.